Hey folks, folks here, welcome back to another Poem Masters video, and today let's check out a 3 out of 5 uh, uh, Lysian Altaria. Uh, I don't have enough Syncorps to Gritter, mainly because I'm missing 100, because there's an extra 100 Syncorps in her event. I already got the first 100, there's still 100 more, that I haven't gotten yet, but I'm out of stamina, so I'm hoping to uh, pick that up, but uh, if you're not, like, most part, for, you know, for the most part, this, this grid is enough for what we're going to do today. Right, um, in terms of like her tech route, she really doesn't have that many nodes, right? Your main one is aggravation, and obviously, you want to pick up a twister, move gauge, refresh, right? So, those are the main ones we picked up. Um, I also picked up on ropes. I'm gonna use her tank, right, and uh, see how that goes. Uh, although the stage we're gonna do, I think it's mostly like physical strikers, and her like physical defense isn't that great, um, in comparison to her special defense. Like, her big one is special defense, but her physical defense is still service block, plus, she gets. You know, plus six uh, physical defense with a trainer move as well. Uh, so there's that. And then also picked up clear view defog. Not that it helps with us with anything at all. I just thought we'd, you know, pick it up. I'd, you know, grab these extra stat nodes as well. Um, I don't remember if they had like excavation or anything. You know, just in case I have excavation or something. Maybe it would help. Probably not though. Um, but yeah, I don't have really much. Just check out the defog stuff. Wait, does she have like a defog move gauge refresh? There's an MPR, I know. Um, maybe should have picked up that instead. I don't think we need that much. I really do think we only need two defogs for the stage we're about to do. We could use a third one, but it's not. Hey, wait, Red is petting the um, charge. Oh, that's cute. Anyways, all right. Um, in the six RX outfit. All right, so uh, for the thing, um. A third one would be helpful for like that last sandstorm, but it's not like necessary. I don't think it's a big deal. Uh, a plus, I'm also out of Syncorps, although I could have went like the other route. You now that I think about it, and pick that up instead. Oh well, too late. <laughs> All right, here's the uh, team we're gonna go with. So uh, Lysian Altaria to tank, um, Sabrina Alexam to set up reflect, and uh, Dar hit all for Synthic Mo heal some people maybe when we need it. And uh, Cynthia Kamo to do damage, big damage, clanging scale damage, right? Um, so here's the game plan. They are going to set up a special shield, and they're also going to set up a crit shield, which is obviously not good for Cynthia, right? So our plan is, after they set up the crit shield, we'll defog and take the shield away, because defog or defog takes away field effects, such as, you know, shields from the opponent's field of play. Um, so we we'll take out those, and then once those are out, I would imagine Cynthia would do, like, a lot of damage, because, y y you know, the big thing with this stage is, if you don't have, you know, something to remove shields, and it doesn't have to be defog, right, it could be other things, um, like, you're missing out on a lot of damage, because you don't get to crit them, right, crits, uh, that's straight up at 1.5 times multiplier, right, so, um, yeah, that's gonna help, and, uh, let's, uh, jump in and, and see how this goes, then. So basically, we're trying to aggravation with our twister, AoE flinch, right? We've got a 70 something percent chance to flinch at least one opponent. And we've got 36% or so to flinch, uh, to, to, uh, you know, four, four, one single flinch, right? So, good rates there. Good, you know, twister, do some stuff. Let's buff our stats up first. Let's throw up a reflect as well while we're at it. Alright. X special attack. Let's get one clanging scales in here. They do have a special shield up right now. They don't have the crit shield up, uh, thankfully, at, at the moment. So that's nice, I guess, for us. Dire head all over here, clanging scales, and then they have their crit shield up over there. After this twister, we could defog that shield, both shields, right, uh, at the same time, which would be pretty helpful. Can we get a flinch in here? That would be nice. Alright, no flinch, unfortunately. Uh... Sybeam in, I guess. Sync move in with uh, Kamo. We do have their shields gone now with uh, Defog, as you can see, which is pretty poggers. Also lowers their evasion by one or two, I guess, since we got two of those. Not that we really need the evasion decrease <laughs> uh, over here in this case. All right, so we're not going to, again, we're not going to showcase, as you can obviously tell, the, uh, the the damage grid for for her over here, right? But uh, her damage grid is uh, interesting, right? Uh, if we're showcasing her damage grid, we wouldn't be healing over here with Sabrina. <laughs> we would want her, you know, HP as low as possible. Oh, we got a flinch on the Salamence. That's nice. I like clanging scales. 
yeah, without without the crit shield, like <laughs> Kamo just like tears through this thing, right? Um, or honestly, it doesn't have to be Kamo. It could be like any unit over here. Let's get another reflect in since that one's going down. Dragon Pulse. I oh, got a flinch on the uh, Dragology, which is Poggers. Another cunning scales in there. Can we get a move gauge refresh? I don't have enough. There we go. Nice. All right. Let's see if the uh, Garchomp throws up like a crit shield again over here or something like that. Uh, side beam. Cunning scales. Ooh, got two. <laughs> Caught two of them over there. That's pretty poggers. Um, two flinches and oh my god! Like we're just like. <laughs> Obviously, this stage is built for Altaria, but like she's just like running through the stage right now, just completely. I mean, well, not damage wise, but you know, with the uh, shield removals, all that stuff, the flinches, right? Not that the flinches help because they got taken out really quick, <laughs> regardless. And there goes that. No, I, well, this is uh... a. I mean, this is an overall relatively, I'd say, relatively easy. I mean, the, the the gimmick here is pretty fun to play with, but I don't think it's. I don't say it's. I wouldn't say it's like on the hard side of the full force battles, but like still, like holy, this is just like a cakewalk, absolute cakewalk, and this guy's about to get two shot. <laughs> GG. We almost had a uh, full full HP clear over here. If only instead of that side beam, I just went with like a six cents over here. On um, Altaria instead, like, oh. bro, Altaria's doing like good damage on like a two gauge twister, man. <laughs> All right, and speaking of good damage, there we go. Poor thing. Well, that was a complete just steamroll. <laughs> that was a complete steamroll. Oh my goodness, what the heck? Heart pounding victory. Vic well, uh, not really. <laughs> um, I mean, yeah, that that not so much of a heart pounding victory. We kind of just rolled over these guys <laughs> so um yeah anyways uh again I'll, I'll check out the damage grid um uh, later if i hopefully get the extra bit of synchros because for her grid damage grid you actually do need uh quite a bit of you know um orbs and, and energy and such right uh although you don't necessarily have to but it's it's just better you know if you get that extra bit of orbs because like she does have like a lot of like these big um energy nodes up here right hp trade-off four wide open right harry three these all you know damage uh grids right for the most part um obviously you want to pick up like some moon blast stuff maybe actually i mean for this stage specifically dragon pulse is better because there's more dragon weak opponents uh but i really did want to check out the moon blast maybe i'll check out mo you know both moon blast and, and dragon pulse in like you know different scenarios or whatever uh, there just isn't that many like very weak opponents <laughs> in comparison, unfortunately. Uh, but yeah, anyways, that's me with this one. I guess hope you guys enjoy. Let me guys think in the comments down below. Uh, like and enjoy this video. Subscribe to the channel for some more Pokemon Masters content. That has to be like one of the quickest showcase videos ever. Just bulldoze through the thing, right? As soon as you remove the shields, like crits on like that full force battle is just gone, right? So, anyways. Um, again, I'll, I'll see if I could, you know, get the rest of the stuff in there as well. So we could check out the damage. And I'll, uh, yeah, see you guys in the next one.